Trade quick tips. Sharpen your skills. In this trade quick tip video, we explain 10 commonly used terms that knife users all around the world know and use when talking about their favorite blades, so that you can join in on the conversation. Along the way, we'll use different knives to illustrate each term, including our Schrade SCHF9, SCHF14, SCH600TI, and the SCHA3BS. If you're going to talk knives with fellow knife enthusiasts, you've got to know the lingo. And proper knife terminology is more than just fun. It's extremely helpful when purchasing, repairing, or using knives. Come along as we work our way from the tip of a knife all the way to its tail. Basic, but important. The blade is the cutting portion, the business end of the knife. Blades come in a wide variety of types, shapes, sizes, metals, and even color, with each characteristic contributing to a knife's intended purpose. Bottom line, no blade, no knife. Serrations are sharpened teeth or grooves found on the blade. Serrations draw material into themselves, making a knife more effective during aggressive cutting. You'll appreciate serrations when you cut rope or other forms of cordage. The choil refers to an unsharpened section of the blade located in front of the finger guard. Use the choil to choke up on a knife for greater blade control. Choils were originally added to knives so the cutting portion of the blade could be more easily sharpened. The small round piece of raised metal found on the side of certain blades is called a thumb knob. Thumb knobs help you open the blade. Most knives having thumb knobs have one on each side of the blade for ambidextrous blade opening. Thumb knobs are sometimes referred to as thumb studs. The handle is the part of the knife you grip in order to use and control it. Handles can be so large they fill your hand, or compact enough to only wrap a few fingers around. Handle material, shape, angles, and color are as varied as the people who grip them and, like the blade, support the knife's primary purpose. Tang refers to the portion of the blade that extends into the handle. A full tang knife is made of a single long piece of metal running from the blade tip to the butt of the knife. In a partial tang knife, the blade metal runs only part way into the handle. Jimping is texture added to the knife for increased grip. Notice the groove jimping on the spine of this knife and on this handle's underside and even near its base. A pommel is the exposed end found at a knife's base. A pommel, if present, usually extends beyond the handle and is used for breaking glass or crushing objects like stone. Located at the base of the handle, a lanyard hole allows cordage, often 550 paracord, to be tied off into a loop you can place around your wrist for increased retention and control especially when conditions may be less than perfect. Deploy is the term used to describe opening a folding knife. Folding knives can be deployed manually or with mechanical assistance for rapid deployment. Schrade carries a wide variety of knives in different sizes, shapes, patterns, colors, and styles to meet almost every imaginable need. To check out our complete selection, visit Schrade.com. But for now, don't forget to subscribe to this Schrade YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more knife survival, camping, and bushcraft tips to help you sharpen your skills. To discover more about the gear used in this video, check out the links in the video description on YouTube. Visit Schrade.com or take a trip to your local outdoor gear retailer.